26 Hemi. I love cars. I love GMs. I don't like Fords. Very few Fords I'd put in my garage. But I would put a 426 Hemi in. And I could put this Hemi in my garage. It's a Corvette 440 cheapo two-door hardtop. But it's got what Jay Leno uses to get away from annoying fans at stoplights. 426 Street Hemi, 1966, the first year for the Street Hemi after Chrysler used them to race real fast. This one's for sale. It's got 21,000 original miles, an old paint job, and it looks real good. It's almost a survivor car, but it's got a different motor and a little bit too much undercoating underneath and a modified exhaust system that we'll show you. But no headers, and it's not a four-speed, one of 96 built with an automatic. And sometimes the automatic's the way to go if you want to go real fast. Oh, I'd buy this car. $50,000, I can't invest in real estate. Two four-barrel Carter four barrel carburetors, two fours. It's done up real nice. It's a bench seat column shift egg drag car, X drag car Coronet 440. They had a satellite, they had Belvedere, a GTX, Coronet. Oh man, Barracuda. What a beauty. Oh, I'd love to have it. Don't sell it, please, because he's got another one even nicer. A survivor car that's going to stay in the garage, and this one's going to go to some happy owner who's going to go really fast. A patina car that had lots of lettering on it from the drag racing days. These cars were all drag raced. Every one of them. If you had one of these, you knew what it was. Got no power brakes, and if you have power brakes, you're not getting to that spark plug. They only had them in '67 and up. No power brakes in '66. But it's a big car to slow down with self-energizing drum brakes, and that's what this one's got. Drum brakes, Silvertown radials, Coronet 440, and it could be yours if you're not going to invest in real estate. That's what I got to do. Rumble, rumble, rumble. Big block, 671. Wowee. As much as I love that Coronet, I love this Belvedere GTX Super Commando 440. Fancier model, a bit less of an engine, it's a 67. That Coronet's nice. This Belvedere is nicer, but it's not a Hemi. Maybe I'd buy both and take the 440 and put it in the Coronet and the Hemi and put it in this. This has got split bucket seats, but no console. The other one has a console that he's got, the patina car. It's pale yellow, which GM called butternut yellow. This one's got the flip open gas cap, vinyl top. It's all dolled up. Chrome exhaust tips. There's that pop open gas cap. We're at Muscle Palooza. We're overwhelmed with beautiful cars. What a great event. We love it here. We love the cars. We love our GMs. But I wouldn't mind a Coronet 440 Street Hemi in my garage. That's the problem. I have too much storage and not enough cars. How do you like that? Let's take a look at this Pontiac. 64. I like the 64 rear end, but I like the 63 nose. Can't have them both. Bench seat, four speed with art work for a dash. Catalina. Billet dash. Pontiac had beautiful dashboards, and this one's got big block Chevy power? What? Where's that 421 when you need it? Very interesting. Big block powered Pontiac 64 Catalina Ventura with Kragers, like an old drag car. It blew the 421. It's got patina crunch. Drum brakes. Uh, 
that's a lot of power for drum brakes. Well, 421s aren't that hard to find, and all Pontiac motors kind of look alike early 60s, right up till the end, late 70s. Big block powered 421 Catalina with Marshall headlamps from Europe. Yeah, no T3s here. Very interesting. I love the patina. I love that coronet. Oh, Maul. That's the problem. Notice before we go back to race. Super B. Ram Charger. 440 Magnum six pack. One of 109 V code 440 six pack four speeds with a super track pack 410 Dana rear end hemi orange with optional C stripe air grabber hood and a tick tock tack in the dash and no power steering or power brakes. This car was built to do one thing go really, really, really pistol grip fast. Oh wow. Well, so much for the cornet. I'm going to buy this one. We do have uh, quite a bit of fluid. Bright orange with a C stripe. Uh, we do ask all of our Just have to buy them all. One of these, one of those, one of those, and one of those, and one of those. No problem. Like I said, a place to put them all, but I don't have enough money. 